An era in naval aviation is coming to a close. The EC-130 Hercules propeller-driven aircraft is being replaced by the turbofan Hermes E-6A. Fleet Reconnaissance Squadron 3 out of Barbers Point Naval Air Station, Hawaii, is the first recipient of the new Take Charge and Move em Out Takamo aircraft. It will enable us to provide a better communication support for our clients, uh, the SSBNs, and they will able, enable us to uh, fly, fly faster and further and uh, have greater endurance than what the C-130s do now. As a matter of fact, the plane carries as much fuel as the C-130 weighs fully fueled. The Navy's EC-130s will be phased out, but their communications equipment will be stripped and put into new E-6As. For the past three months, VQ-3 personnel have been working with instructors from Boeing aircraft learning the new systems. Uh, an easy check to see that all of them are, all of them are turning as you check that that flex shaft right up there. Because you know Although the Hercules planes have provided the squadron with just under 100,000 accident-free flight hours, they just can't keep up with the Navy's new communications technology. The E-6A can do that. They'll also provide us some capability for the airplanes and our comm mission to grow over the next years. There are some communications improvements in, uh, that are planned right now. Some of them are actually in production. Uh, this plane can take those where the C-130 could, and it was at the limit of its growth potential. The E-6A is expected to take the Navy's Takamo mission into the next century and far beyond. Petty Officer Kathy Hines, Barbers Point Naval Air Station, Hawaii.